Hello everyone, welcome back to a new session on dentistry and more. So today's topic is Indian Dental Association. So Indian Dental Association is for the well-being of dental professionals and dentistry as a whole and at the same time they are well concerned with the dental health needs of Indian civilization and their upliftment in that aspect. So it is basically for uh, welfare of a dentist and for uh, conducting more programs which can benefit dentist actually you no know, law behind this uh, like dca dental council of india is totally a government body which is based on the dentist act of india which are supposed to maintain the quality of dentistry in our country but idea is not such a body it is just for the uh, encouraging dentists in their profession and as well as uh, to uh, have a, a quality uh, dental treatment by providing a more of uh, dental education materials and seminars and other programs so that the dentist can work in a productive way at the same time they keep uh, conferences and other uh, uh, other programs uh, for the encouragement and uh, a totality of a dentistry so this idea is uh, unlike Dental Council of India is not bound to any particular law. So it was first started in 1928 by the father of Indian dentistry that is Aramad. So it was uh, first known as All India Dental Association. After the Dentist Act and Dental Council of India came into existence the name changed to IDA. So this was the first started in uh, Bengal. Bengal uh, branch was the first IDA branch or All India Dental Association branch in India. So what are the objectives of IDA? So it is as I said there is no law behind it. So it is to promote, encourage and advance the dental and allied sciences to encourage its members to undertake measures for improvement of public health and education, maintenance of honor and dignity and the uploading of upholding of the interest of dental profession and cooperation between the members so basically these are the objectives and let's see the members of idea it has a jumbo committee so one president and one president elect one immediate past president president is the current working president one president elect is the next one who are supposed to join after this president resigns and one immediate past president was completed his tenure last time and three vice presidents one honorary general secretary and one assistant general secretary one treasurer one secretary of uh, cdh and one editor for a particular journal idea journal so there are various branches of idea there are many local level branches and state level branches there are 29 state branches, 7 union territory branches, around 450 local branches and 1 defense branches. So how do we take membership? So we can uh, take honorary members. So they are like or reserved for the pioneers of Indian dentistry and very reputed people and those who have contributed a lot to indian dentistry they will be getting honorary members life members once we taken this life membership it is for final we don't need to renew it so annual members is like how every dentist uh, does that every year they renew their membership fees direct members and affiliate members we are practicing and our home is at that particular place we can join and affiliate members we are practicing at a different uh, position and uh, we are we are our home or our uh, place a different place we can affiliate to a, another branch students members means uh, students can um, participate in activities of Indian Dental Association by joining as a student member once they become dentist they need to go for annual members so functions they keep annual conferences at national state and local branches they conduct various programs uh, conferences webinars and other programs for the betterment of dentistry and they have paper presentations and uh, talks on different topics expressing their views by the expert people and conduct programs such as continuing dental health education programs seminars 
and hands-on training various lectures and panel discussions and they also uh, conduct school dental health checkups and dental treatment camp for the community so they provide awareness program about dental health to the school children and even to the public and to conduct program on uh, specific days like not tobacco day cancer day oral health day or on hygiene day so all these days uh, this idea will uh, conduct various programs and conduct dental treatment and screening camps in association with various NGOs and they publish a journal every month so every local branch and uh, national or state branch has different different journals so they publish uh, journals it is for the students and uh, dentist they can publish their work or research work or review uh, in the particular journal so that is all about indian dental association so a little bit about his its history its membership its branches and uh, its committee okay, and a little bit of objectives so that's all about indian dental association uh, the next topic is dental council of india so thank you